Today I'm going to be talking about how you should stop drinking sodas and drink more water. Introduction. I'm going to talk about the health risk, what's in the soda that's really bad for you, um, how you can stop drinking sodas, and I'm going to also explain some of the results that I got from surveys in the class. Health risk. Drinking a uh, soda will boost your risk of having a stroke, uh, cancer, obesity, damage to the kidneys, and elevated blood pressure. Drinking Dr. Pepper will increase your chances of having kidney damage and kidney stones. But Coke, it will more likely high blood pressure and risk of stroke. What is in the soda that makes it so bad? Soda contains acid, which uh, interferes with your body and makes it unable to absorb caffeine. Caffeine is also hard on your body. Uh, if you don't drink too much soda, or if you drink too much soda, it can lead to cancer, actually. Uh, the water in most soda is just from tap, so there's a lot of chlorine and germs, but if you have, I don't know about some companies that produce soda, if they have a filter or not, how to stop drinking soda. If you're not able to quit drinking soda cold turkey, then there's a process. But if you are able to quit cold turkey, there's probably going to be side effects like headaches, dizziness, and stuff like that, which I would not recommend. So go with this path. If you drink 12 sodas per week or something, like if you drink your cold sodas the first week, then drink your six sodas your second week, and then your three sodas the third week. But once you get to the fourth week, once you get down to like one or two, or even the third week, you could mix water with your sodas. I mean, it would be like help out tremendously. And, um, after a couple weeks of doing this method, you should be able to quit. I mean, some people probably won't. They're still gonna have the headaches and dizziness and stuff. I mean, if you're really dedicated and trying to help your health, I mean, I hope you to do this. I mean, I've went 12 or like 18 weeks before without drinking soda. I mean, I felt the, I was in the best shape of my life, honestly. And the results that I got in today, or in the surveys from your class, uh, normally a person drank three to four cups of soda a day. That was only half of the class. Some people didn't even drink soda, but I mean, it really depends. And the flavor that everyone chose the most was Coke, which Coke is the worst drink you could absolutely drink. And it leads to strokes and stuff like that. Um, cancer, most of it's obesity. Some set, or I watched a video and uh, someone poured Coke on a battery because there's battery acid all over the battery and actually it caused the battery or the erosion to go away. And uh, um, I hope you have learned something today. I mean, to me, I try to stop drinking sodas or cut back to at least one or two a week, but the most I'll drink is two. I mean, sodas can cause more than just health issues. It can cause like teeth problems, decay, I mean, sodas are just, it's like alcohol, I mean, it's just terrible for your body, you don't even need to be drinking it, really, I mean, people just do it for flavor, caffeine, I mean, caffeine, you need to stop, caffeine's terrible for your body, but, I mean, I hope I persuaded you to go out and change your habits today, so, and I hope you find something to say, and hope you start changing your life. Thank you for listening.